Now let's move to the removing of the image. But before that, let me do some cleanups. Like I want this to be over all the width. So I will open the app.js and I call this width full. And in that way, we will have images like this. Or maybe we can give like 10 by 12 in that way yeah that's okay and next is I want to do uh, I want to have some little space on the next line for that we will go to the images and we can give every image margin Y of uh, let's say 4 and now yeah we have this next we can next we can see if the text box is empty even after that I can add an image which is not good thing because we don't have any URL so we need to check that if this input field doesn't have any value then we are not going to add anything or maybe we can disable this add button so how we can do that and first thing is we have this we have this handle add here we are doing these things pushing new image but we can check we are only going to do this if new image URL is not equal to empty strings and then only I'm going to push a new image here and by doing this if I can if I click on this that's not adding any image okay but uh, I also want this button to be disabled so how we can disable any button so this button is here okay so to disable let's give the disabled attribute and see uh, but this is not looking as disabled yes it is actually disabled but it's not looking so to make uh, to make this button looks like a disabled I'm going to convert the class into a dynamic class like this and now I'm going to bind the class using JavaScript so I'm going to use these uh, backticks inside that I will put these classes now this is also going to work absolutely fine okay but then I need to check and uh, to check inside this uh, backticks in the template literal we are going to use dollar and once again the curly braces this is going to start the javascript between this uh, backticks now i can say if the new image url is not equal to or is uh, okay yeah try not equal to empty string then i am going to do nothing so no new class otherwise uh, let's do one thing <laughs> so when it is not empty then the background color is green 600 otherwise background is green 200 only and oops I did wrong like here I need to push after this question mark and then 300 will come like here now let's see you can see this is looking like a disabled one also we can provide the disabled attribute so one more disabled is only going to bind new image URL is not equal to empty string if this is true or I think uh, disabled when it is equal to empty string so when empty string is there then the button will be disabled okay now I cannot click it is looking like a disabled as soon as I type something yes it is there and we can add any new image obviously that was not the correct URL okay so one last thing uh, let's make this text box to fill all the in all the width so here width is full and let's try okay so this is looking bad 
uh, what I can do next I'm going to create a div like here and then move this div like this and giving a class of uh, widthful then widthful let's try yeah that's good and once again similar to this input field we need to move this button also into a div of widthful or uh, not widthful but just a simple div so that we have but it's not doing that kind of thing mm, what happened here it's taking all the shape because of maybe because of the name so if I just say add yeah that's okay and I need to give some margin margin left of 2 cool now we we are ready to move and one very last thing is I want these images to be at the center you can see it is pushed at the left so how about this justify center is there and justify center so i can inspect first and let's see where we are having so this is the one and we are having okay so you can see one by three we have given and this is not taking it at the center so we need to go to the show images and here I can say text center is it going to work no it's not going to work so once again we need to use flex or you can try from here class I remove the text center I will give the flex and justify center whoa this will going to work surely so remove it and like this toggle image yeah everything is at the center now let's move to the removing of the images